us head back to Pakistan where we're joined there by our correspondent as we continue our coverage on the hundreds of children who died in Pakistan in 2012. And Daniel Han, that's a staggering figure. What's the latest that we have on this ongoing outbreak and what explanation have officials at least offered for the surge in numbers of fatalities there? The World, uh, World Health Organization has released this report on measles in Pakistan, and according to which uh, 260 people have died of measles in only the Sindh province, while according to unofficial reports, more than uh, 360 people have uh, uh, children have perished. And the health experts believe that the outbreak of this deadly and contagious disease among children is due to improper sanitary conditions, which we see in the uh, province of Sindh. And uh, Sindh was the worst uh, flood affected province in 2010 as well as in uh, 2011. And since the floods, the government of Pakistan has been unable to reach the affected people uh, to at least provide them with any basic kind of health care facilities. And according to the statistics uh, uh, of the WHO uh, report, uh, over 7,270 cases of measles uh, were reported in the uh, province of Sindh alone. Yes. Daniel, you mentioned there the World Health Organization because it's actively partnering Pakistan to control uh, contagious diseases, including measles. In this particular case, though, what does the world body say about the outbreak and the action that the government says it is taking? Well, according to the World Health Organization, the increase in measles, uh, measles cases in the country could be a result of insufficient immunization coverage and the figures collected from official sources and surveys provide evidence of the current outbreak of the measles and WHO says that the government's uh, expanded program on immunization, the EPI, which is technically supported by the WHO and UNICEF, is aimed at protecting children by immunizing them against childhood uh, TB, uh, uh, hepatitis B, as well as measles. But unfortunately, according to the survey of Pakistan's social and living standards, uh, Pakistan's routine immunization coverage does not meet the optimal routine and uh, than 80 percent. And uh, WHO also says that huge difference in routine of immunization coverage between the provinces uh, is there, and uh, uh, the government seems to be struggling as far as controlling uh, the uh, the epidemic. And the experts maintain that. Uh, the disease is likely to spread for some time as there are many inaccessible parts of the province which, uh, which have not been accessed uh, by the government or the health officials yet. Yes. Daniel, I have to ask you also, because I'm sure many people watching this program at home will be wondering and shocked also that hundreds of children are dying from a disease which is as treatable as measles. Is it a case uh, that Pakistan has unsanitary conditions in certain parts?